Good morning from Tibils. Check out the ruins behind me that people still live in actually. Over there you can see our couches. And it's a beautiful warm day. Although um, pretty much all of Tibils and all of Georgia is closed. And let me just introduce you to my uh, driver for the next few days. Hi, my name is Julian. <laughs> so I'm venturing out on a uh, trip in the Caucasus and then onwards into Turkey and to Eastern Europe. And um, I will bring you along, of course. Oh, check this out. I hope you're not... Uh, hope you're not breaking through the roof here. Wow, look at that. Hello. There's people. All right, whatever is going on, let's explore. All right, let's see if someone's home. Hello? Maybe i give you guys a, uh, a tour. But this, I found out, is the best pasta in Georgia. <laughs> and we treated uh, ourselves to some, uh, some blackberries from a, I bought it from an old babushka for, for two lari which is um, or three lari actually which is just more than just more than half a euro <laughs> look at this house wow look at that would you live here? They have a pool outside. They have uh, they have the laundry out. They have a pool. Wow. You can hear radio from from every other entrance and window. Okay. This building seems to be almost falling apart. Well, it is falling apart already, and they kind of just built a fence around it, so no one and no one really uh, goes close uh, in order for not to hurt people because, <laughs> like, things can fall down and, and come down any any minute. And it seems like people are still living in there. Actually, I don't know. It's crazy, man. And there's so many buildings like these here. The name Tibils is an old expression in the central Caucasian language of Georgian. It can be translated to hot springs. And it is no coincidence that the city is actually called Hot Springs or Tibils. As you might have expected, um, there is some mighty medieval hot springs located in the city here that are actually um, supposed to heal your mind and your body and we are now going to check out where they originate from and then we're going to see if we can hop into one of these uh, in these sulfur bars because we don't have a reservation we just found out that it's it's not good to not have a reservation so let's see but along um, this little valley here people walk in to find the origin of the hot springs. In the 17th century, the city had around 70 different individual bath houses that offered a dip and a hot sulfurous water that came from uh, deeper within the ground underneath the city of Tibils. And you could only um, see those hot springs because there were um, cupolas rising up from the ground uh, to uh, to facilitate the hot springs underneath and today those uh, bathhouses are more modern and of course somehow more luxurious and let's have a look around now I think here Julian is already buying something what did you buy man wow yeah, it's a mix from grapefruit from pomegranate and lemon Alright, let's try it. 
Wow, how is Very it? Very delicious. <laughs> Amazing, let's see. This is where the hot springs originate. Over there where the people are, there's a waterfall. Wow. Look at that, so many people pilgriming in here. And these are the cupolas that you can still see. Over there there's more actually. Let's check them out. And the sulfur bars are behind those cupolas or underneath them. So you will see soon, but it's a whole room underneath the cupola. Okay, this is our room. Let's check it out. I'll give you a room tour. Wow. Look at the ceiling. And this is our, our chill out area, apparently it seems. And now we're entering the sulfur bath area. What? Look at that. <laughs> With the sauna. The toilet actually. Wow, let's see the sauna. Man. It is... It's actually a sauna outside already. It, it was 34 degrees today. Let's see, and this is the, this is the, this is the sulfur. Oh wow, that's cold. And that's hot. Amazing. This is, oh look at the lady. We're gonna have a bath with a lady. And here, shines. Hello. Look at that, yeah, amazing. And this, I've not been told, but I'm, I'm suggesting, I think, that this is... Now, that, this one is not hot, but the one outside is actually hot. And here, this one, it's actually hot. It's like a hot stone. Oh, it's so hot, it's like I'm grilling myself on a barbecue. You can see the hole in the, in the, in the very top where you can see outside to the sky. And this is where all the air evaporates and this is one of the cupolas. One of those cupolas that you could see from outside. We are gonna go, I think we're gonna go take a dip now, of course, in the sulfur. My, you should, you should um, smell the sulfur, it's amazing. Let's see, oh wow. Oh my God, oh that's hot. It's like the onsen in Japan. It's crazy hot. And now we're going to cold. Oh. Wow. What a feeling. All right. I'll catch you guys. I'll catch you guys when we're done. Another cupola here. Wow. Okay, let's dip in the ice cold. <sighs> Sulfur. After we've been in the, in the, in the sauna. All right. Oh. Um, this is supposed to be George's number one beer. Let's take a real dip now. Oh. Love it. This concludes our trip to the spa, the Georgian spa. What a nice day, what an exhausting day. And I'm chilling here in this chair inside the cap, uh, the, the, the capsule, the cupola. And I'm signing off for today. Um, see you guys in the next video.